Hey everybody, uh, we're back here at the church and I wanted to come back and give you a quick video on how to get ProPresenter into the A10 Mini Pro or the A10 Mini Extreme. A lot of people ask about this. If you're using PowerPoint, if you're using Keynote, ProPresenter, Easy Worship, or any of the other ones, it all kind of works the same. And so I'm gonna show you our setup. I'm gonna show you how we're using the A10 Extreme and uh, show you how we have ProPresenter going into it. And then, you know, if, uh, you have any questions you can send it to us or maybe it'll give you some ideas of, of what to do but let's check it out real quick so this is our setup in our sound booth we run our live stream off the a10 mini extreme we do have it going through ecamm for for a couple reasons but um we're, we're running pretty much everything off the a10 extreme and uh the a10 extreme and input number four we have our pro presenter this is our pro presenter machine it's showing things up on the screen here and then it is a mac mini so the hdmi output of the mac mini comes into this screen the hdmi output 2 goes into let's see if i can show you that um can't really see it back there into this little thing hdmi output 2 of the of the mac mini is coming here and then one of those hdmi cables goes out to uh to the screens up there to another splitter and then one of them goes out to input number four here in the atem extreme so um we use our pro presenter machine you can it's the same thing with with powerpoint easy worship anything like that we're using it simply as another video feed so it is full screen if we want to switch to that it's going to be full screen unless we're using the picture in picture of the a10 mini and, and uh using some things that way um we're kind of limited to doing this because we're using the a10 mini as our uh as our pro presenter machine however um if you had like a pc or something or a, a bigger mac with more hdmi outputs available you could actually do an output of this of uh, pro presenter that is unique to the a10 mini and if you do that you can do lower thirds with it you can do keying so that um, the lyrics instead of instead of being full screen you know kind of like this the lyrics will be lower thirds kind of overlaying the the video in the lower third uh, we can't do it that way because we only have two outputs one two <laughs> and so if we if we made those into lower thirds for this it would be lower thirds up there which would just get really janky uh so we're we're kind of limited to that way but this is really what most people need anyway um because they're not doing too many fancy overlays if you get into the overlays um you're going to have better machines than we do um here in this church it's not hard to do you just need another output and then you need to program pro presenter into you basically program the screens with a with an additional look you have to edit your looks and you would do like a lower third for the live stream and and um, edit the looks there and uh, do other templates for your lyrics and everything and so it's pretty involved in pro presenter but uh, getting it into the a10 mini is actually really really easy you just come hdmi out into the back of the a10 mini and then it takes up one of your camera ports so um, one of the great things about using something like Pro Presenter with, with the A10 Mini is if you, uh, if you play like a, like a video, um, it comes directly in. So the video that's playing up there now, which is a countdown video, plays here. So on Sunday, if I want to uh, cut to program um, the, the live stream, this is what the live stream sees for 10 minutes um, leading up to us actually going live. And then we'll cut back to uh, camera number one and you can see our cameras here camera one is the ptz you can zoom in on that um you can see the ptz camera zooming in there um or camera two is on our keyboard camera three is the pulpit camera one is the ptz and uh right now that's kind of you can see the the overhang of the balcony i just hate that but there's nothing we can do about it. So we're working on some solutions, repositioning our cameras and everything to make that a little bit better. But um, but yeah, that's how you get ProPresenter, the easiest way to get ProPresenter from a Mac or whatever into the A10 Mini Pro or the A10 Mini Extreme. Just plug it into the back and use it like a video source.